good. I went to Austin, hung out with the fam. Just didn't really do much. Just relax, get my body right. Since the quality time with my two boys and my fiance. Four out of the last six games are against divisional opponents. Mm -hmm. chance, chance for you guys to really get back in this thing. You yeah. guys approach it like we control our own destiny, that kind of thing? Yeah, I think a lot of teams are kind of in the same spot. You know, five and five, six and four. There's not too many teams that even have more than seven wins. So I think in November, people remember November. I think this is when you separate yourself as a team um, and you make a playoff push. So, yes, each game is critical. Each game is a playoff game. Obviously, you faced Minshew in the first game, got Foles mm -hmm. this week. How much different, where do they differ, I guess? This week? Uh, I mean, I mean, Nick Foles has won a Super Bowl. He's a Super Bowl MVP. Um, he's won a lot of games in this league. Um, he's a good quarterback. I mean, Minshew started out hot, um, played great for him. I mean, we're still playing good. Um, obviously, they brought Foles in to, you know, kind of lead that team. So, um, there, I mean, there's some differences, but they're both very accurate. Um, Foles will push the ball downfield, um, but nothing crazy. Does, does it seem like a year ago since that first game? I know it's so early in the season. It really does. Game. Watching the film, I'm like, man, I don't even remember playing that game. But uh, it does feel like a long time. But just watching the film, it clicks back pretty quick. Yeah. You guys usually have usually one receiver, one maybe two receivers to worry about. They, they got a whole fleet over there in Jacksonville, don't they? Yeah, with the emergence of Shark. I mean, I think at the beginning of the year, nobody was saying they had a fleet of receivers. Now everybody's <laughs> saying they got a fleet. But now nah, he's done a hell of a job. Um, Shark, uh, Conley. Uh, D.D. Westbrook, those, those those three guys present a, a good challenge. And Marone said that he kind of regretted not using Fournette more last week. Do you expect to see more of him this week? I would think so. I mean, Fournette's, I mean, a great player, um, focal point of their offense. I think he had eight carries last week, um, and he's more of a workhorse guy in my opinion, so I'm sure he'll get more than eight carries. What's the key to maintaining how good you guys have been on defense over the course of the season as mm -hmm. it gets later. Things start to uh, obviously outside of health. Um, we just got to get back to, for us, these, these last couple of games, just get back to the details, playing how we've been playing at the beginning of the season with our effort and our finish. Um, some, of the, like, some of the things that separates us from other defenses, I think we lost a little bit these last games. We tailed off a little bit. I think we'll get that back. We're not worried about it. We just got to get back to the details of, of each and every assignment. Is it just in terms of like big plays that you guys are giving up? Oh, it could be anything. It could be ten yard run. It could be a, a big play. It could be a, a conversion on third down. We got to get off the field on third down too. So, and I think that's all just in the details of our assignment.